the polar form of i to the power of 25 whole power 3. So polar form of a complex number. z is equal to x plus i y can be taken as r of cos theta plus i sin theta where r is equal to mod z that is root over x square plus y square and theta is the argument of z argument of z where theta lies between minus pi to plus pi. Okay, and now let us simplify first i to the power of 25 given complex number z is equal to i to the power of 25 whole to the power of 3. So, which can be written i to the power of 75. And if you divide with 4, 4 18 times 72 plus 3. So it is in the form of i to the power of 4n plus 3 since we know that i to the power of 4n is 1. i to the power of 4n plus 1 when it leaves the remainder 1 when divided with 4 which is i and the power when it is divided with 4 and leaves the remainder 2. 4n plus 2 that is i square is minus 1. i to the power of 4n plus 2 is equal to i square that is minus 1 and i to the power of 4n plus 3 which is equal to i to the power of 3 that is minus i. So it is in the form of 4 into n plus 3. So we can write this as minus i. So our complex number z is equal to minus i and then mod z is equal to modulus of minus i which is equal to root of 0 plus minus 1 whole square. So which is root 1 and 1 we can consider since mod z is the mod is always positive. And also argument of argument of z which is equal to argument of minus i and since we know that minus i is located on the negative axis so minus i is nothing but 0 comma minus 1 which is on negative y axis so the angle can be taken minus pi by 2 and for i argument of i is equal to we can remember argument of i is equal to pi by 2 which is in the positive direction of y axis plus 90 degrees or pi by 2 or argument of minus i can be taken minus pi by 2. So we can write here minus pi by 2 therefore polar form of polar form of complex number z is equal to minus i is r r is here 1 so this is r 1 times of cos theta so theta is minus pi by 2 so cos of minus pi by 2 plus i sine of minus pi by 2 so that is cos pi by 2 minus i sine pi by 2 since cos of minus theta is plus cos theta so we can go with an option fourth option right please like share subscribe and support us Thank you.